Hello everyone, this is Taria from Hidden Truth Tarot and this is going to be for the sign of Gemini. Gemini, this is your reading for how the energy of the new moon in Taurus may be affecting you, alright? So I'm using the Tarot of Dreams to pull a major energy. Beautiful, you guys. So you have the sun coming through here. Very powerful energy uh, that's going to be taking place uh, with you, Gemini, during this Taurus new moon. Um, I'm also using the Morgan Greer Tarot. Now, I do want to go ahead and say that with this Taurus new moon, uh, these energies can really affect you a few days before and during and a few days after the new moon as well. So just keep that in mind. That's my opinion. It really does have an effect on our energy. Now, this Taurus new moon is a representation of new beginnings, taking a leap of faith and moving start forward and starting something new Gemini so this is beautiful for your major energy the Sun coming up here I just love it so let's go ahead and let's take a look at your tarot and then we will go over each one of them all right thank you spirit and we are ready all right Gemini you have the moon coming out here and I love this all right we have the Nine of Swords, Knight of Rods, Two of Cups, Eight of Rods. We have the Nine of Rods, the Hermit, and the two of rods very interesting all right gemini so let's see how this new moon in taurus is going to be affecting your energy so i pulled this for the major energy here for you gemini uh, i love the sun and the sun to me is the representation of leo uh, the lion which is all about self-confidence and strength as well you know, the sun coming out here for you, Gemini, represents discovering the truth, having clarity, creativity, success. This can even represent childbirth as well. Uh, this is just a beautiful energy. This is where things may have been very unclear for you. And especially when you have the sun and the moon coming up in a reading together, wherever it's been unclear on along your path, Gemini, uh, you have clarity now you can see you know where you're going where you're headed you have foresight uh, along your path your journey so just beautiful energy is coming through here the moon this is the energy of pisces and it's clarified by the eight of rods so like i said where things have been unclear um maybe not seeing uh being able to see clearly how you are going to get from you know point a to point b to point c you have that clarity now this can also represent downloads of spiritual uh downloads dreams synchronicities symbolism and i will tell you uh you know 99 and 22 may uh, be something that means something to many of you when it comes to numbers so just keep that in mind because you have that here as well. So things that have been unclear, uh, you have clarity now. And I feel like it has to do with this uh, Eight of Rods coming in here. This is exciting news, you guys, that you've been waiting on. This is you rushing ahead, taking action. This is options here. And these are options that you're very excited about. Uh, this can be you know emails coming in news coming in alerting you to uh this new direction where you can see clearly now and you have this clarity coming in something you're very passionate about gemini now we have the nine of swords clarified by the nine of rods um the nine of swords can represent a feeling of being all tied up like he is right there with his wrist uh this is the energy uh possibly of sleepless nights 
um, maybe a little bit of worry that has been going on in your life, Gemini. You could be overwhelmed by your feelings or emotions. And I feel like the reason why is because you have the Nine of Rods uh, clarifying this Nine of Swords, which is, to me, I feel like this is good. I, I realize that there have been some challenging times, but with this uh, energy of the new moon and Taurus coming in here, you're going to have clarity on this new beginning and direction of where you want to go, Gemini. And the Nine of Rods to me is the Wounded Warrior uh, card. Uh, this is the energy of, you know, he's collected all of these rods. He's possibly wounded. But what's beautiful about this energy right here is the perseverance. This is you having that inner strength to still uh, move forward and go after what it is that you truly want. And if you'll notice, he's facing this eight of rods that's coming in. You're going after what it is that you truly want, what you desire, uh, whatever this is that you're very passionate about. You have been through a lot, I feel like, Gemini. Um, just it, it, But you have pulled upon your inner strength and your inner wisdom and you are moving forward. Now we have the Knight of Rods clarified by the Hermit. The Knight of Rods is the energy of Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Uh, the Knight of Rods is that passion that is moving you forward. You taking that leap of faith. And what did I tell you at the beginning of the reading? This uh, new moon in Taurus is about taking a leap of faith, starting a new beginning, and moving forward. And that's what's going on here. Now, you're very passionate about it as well. Uh, it's clarified by the Hermit, which is the energy of Virgo. This is you um, gaining this spiritual enlightenment, uh, changing direction, knowing which direction it is that you're wanting to go in, and having that inner peace and patience with yourself to be able to take this passion and this desire of what it is that you're going after during this new moon in Taurus and moving forward. All right, you're gaining enlightenment here. Now we have the Two of Cups clarified by the Two of Rods. Very interesting here. Um, and I just did a reading. I don't remember which sign it was, but they had 99 and 22 as well. Uh, so very interesting, you guys. Now the Two of Cups is all about connection, commitment, this could be a personal commitment. This could be a business uh, opportunity. Uh, for some of you, this could be romance. This could also have to do with you becoming one with your higher self, I feel like. You know, connection with your mind, body, and spirit. So, there, I feel like there's an opportunity here for you guys. And if this is a contract, you have clarity right now. You're going to be able to progress and move forward because you know... Uh, you know what is in this contract. You know it's something you can move forward on. If this is a business deal, you know what to do. You have clarity now. Uh, for some of you, this is all about, you know, making a commitment to move forward, uh, achieving personal powers here with the two of rods coming through here as well. Uh, you see he's holding the world here in his hands. Um, it's kind of like being at a crossroads, but now you have clarity on which direction to move. Uh, I feel like this is something that it's not really a crossroads for you. You you know which path, you know which door that you need to walk through now uh, with whatever this commitment or this connection is with you, Gemini. And I feel like, you know, the sun is just shining on you guys through this uh, Taurus new moon. Gemini, this is a very positive time for you. If you've been feeling in challenged or coming out of a space of maybe some hard times, uh, things are looking brighter, the sun is shining on you, and things are clearer. You have clarity coming through here. All right, you guys. Gemini, please leave me a comment. I read all of them. I send you all my love wishes and blessings, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye, Gemini.